Hi, I'm glad that you've made it this far in this course and whatever you have learned now is the hardest part and once you are very familiar with the concepts that were taught in this uh, course you'll be able to learn even more complex stuff and can develop really good applications. So in this video uh, I'm going to just give you a few more uh, sources where you could uh, learn a lot about Android and uh, Android has a really strong community therefore you can find a lot of blogs and uh, uh, websites that could help you with a lot of uh, Android concepts. The most notable ones are uh, three of these. The first one is the developer.android.com site. It is the official Android developer website and it contains a lot of resources about uh, developing apps for Android. There is also a training material which you can used to learn new Android concepts and also with developer.android.com there is an associated blog where Google developers make announcements with new Android features and code examples you can use that it's a really helpful blog to stay updated with the Android features and there is also a site called stackoverflow.com it is a really helpful Android community uh, a lot of people ask a lot of questions You'll be surprised to see that most of the problems that you face while developing Android has already been answered on stackoverflow.com. And also if you have a new problem that has to be solved, there are a lot of people who are willing to help you on Stack Overflow. And the third one is github.com where you can find a lot of open source projects, not necessarily Android, but a lot of top developers showcase their uh, libraries or code examples on GitHub and this is one place where you can uh, get a lot of code and you can actually look into the code and learn a lot of new things so apart from these there are a lot of other uh, resources uh, such as you could find online communities in Facebook and uh, Google Plus and there are also a little things that you can do to help me improve this course the first thing you can do is to send me an email to my email address which is ragunathjawahar at gmail.com and please use uh, help from Udemy as your email subject because I tend to lose a lot of emails. You can give me constructive feedback on the course. You can also send me suggestions and if you have any ideas for a new course that is related to Android, you can just email me so that I can start working on it. And you can also follow me on Twitter at the Twitter handle at rate of Raghunath Jawahar. And I also have a GitHub account where I um, upload uh, open source software or libraries that could be helpful to other Android developers and you can check out the repositories I have created and that could be really helpful to you. If you really like this course you can suggest this course to your colleagues or friends or people you know so that they could learn Android easily and thanks for your time you have spent a lot of time on this and it is definitely going to pay you in some way not necessarily financial if programming is your passion you're going to learn you're going to get a lot of emotional value out of this and thank you thank you for taking the course all the best